What you want? Golden Delicious. Red Delicious. No. You like Honey Crisp. Like it's only one lamb. Is this Honey Crisp? What that is? Say Honey Bear. The label right there. Okay, guys, so we're in Aldi and we are um, trying to stock up on some stuff that we've been wanting to stock up on for a while. This is what the part looking like thus far. Um, this started going down fast when Trail got back. Mm hmm. That's the honey bag. Yeah, right here. Peanut butter sandwiches with honey. That is. Peanut butter sandwiches with honey. Oh, yeah, he was obsessed with that. Um, what, Peter Pan? Is it Peter Pan with honey? I want the original. What else is up there? Honey barbecue? Barbecue sauce? Honey. Original hickory and brown sugar. Oh, all of them original. What's going on? The spotlight just Oh, the meat market. Oh, when they marked it down. That was years ago, though. Yeah, that's all I'm saying. You gotta figure out when they mark this stuff. Here in Walmart. Trust should know that by working in the meat department, but they might do it throughout the day. Hey, bye. He probably ain't gonna realize it too. Mm -hmm. Y'all be buying this stuff and y'all be doing this and y'all be buying this. Uh-huh. Mm. He ain't gonna realize it, baby. He won't move out. All right, let's see what we need. I did want some cabbage. I haven't had no cabbage in a while. Yeah, I'll wait till I get that because if I don't cook it right then, I'll be like, I'm going to cook it, I'm going to cook it. Oh, baked potatoes, though, would be good, though. And JJ loves some baked potatoes. You can get a bag. Is the ones in the bin, those are smaller potatoes, aren't they? But are they good for like bacon? Like they gonna be real small. Yeah, they're small. You just get these. How much is three forty nine, two sixty nine? And these are actually bacon potatoes. Well, it really don't matter, but it does. Mm -hmm. Okay, I don't think I need any rice. I did wanna um try some um. Quinoa. Quinoa. It's my quinoa bag. Yeah. I ain't trying to hear that quinoa. Let's see, they got the organic. Taco shells. Probably need to stock up on taco seasoning, but really, you can make your own. Do I need, they got everything but the bagel seasoning now. I need some pepper. And I think I need some um, EVOO. Huh? Why you gonna get it if it's wet? 
it's probably um I don't forgot what's the pure um the pure way was it isolate is the pure thing anyway I'm tired of thinking let's see brown sugar yeah that's the kind they like and I tried the protein pancake. This is said he liked it, but I didn't like it. I didn't like it at all. Them protein pancakes. Them protein pancakes. Um, let's see. Protein meal bars. Protein dark chocolate. I haven't tried these, y'all. Let's see. The organic. I was thinking about getting the oregano. The basil. Mm, you getting hungry? They don't have wipes in here. And I haven't tried this either. So, I might try it another day. They have ginger, too. It's back there in the back. Some cashew bars, chocolate pretzel, and almond. I haven't never tried that one before. I might try this one. 139. Um, uh, let's see. Do I need anything else over here? Um, and get some. I'm trying to get stuff, y'all, that we normally get and just stock up on it. I'm just not left with the cart. Saya loves cornbread. So. Uh, don't need no paper towels. Probably paper plates. It's, we got two brushes at home. Oh, I gotta reschedule my appointment. I suppose to went today. My dentist appointment. Oh, these um shaped differently. I don't feel like going today. Let's see. Oh, I need some aluminum foil. There's your disinfectant wipes, Jason. They don't went up. They used to be like two ninety nine, two eighty nine. It's three oh five. I really got some couponing recently, but I don't want you to take those yet. You gonna keep that in your car? Them disinfectant wipes. Yeah, you need to get your own. You gonna keep it in your car? Hello, hopefuls. Thanks so much for coming back to my channel today. I hope you guys are doing great. I'm doing wonderful. Um, today's haul is an Aldi haul. It's a really big haul. And um, my husband and I, we wanted to stock up for some time now. I have been wanting to stock up on like um, certain things for years and then say I'm going to do it and I don't do it. So um, my total that I spent today was $2.56. Um, I have to look at the change. But, um, what I will do, uh, it will take me a while to put it on the blog, but I will put a link below to the blog post, um, for this. It may not be right away, but you can reference back to it. Um, it's going to be multiple stock ups. Yeah, stock ups. So I'll talk about that in one second. Um, so I'll put a link below. I'm rearranging my homepage so you won't see like the latest post first and it'll be under either cooking or meal plan so i'll put the link below and then i'll caption whatever if you want to see the other pictures with the prices on the blog that will be i'll caption the exact category <laughs> that it's under that you can find it really quickly okay um yeah let's get started with this 
Uh, we had a busy day. I am tired. We went to the gym. Then we went to the store and I wanted to do it when I had some help. Um, Should have did it yesterday with all the boys to help. But Jason and I got it done. And then the boys have a doctor's appointment later. So yeah. Okay, so let's start over here. Um, earlier today, it's a couple of things on the counter. I did get a shipped order um, because we... I meant to go to the grocery store, but I didn't go to the grocery store yesterday. And JJ ne Josiah needed some stuff for lunch. So, um, they delivered the stuff right when it was about time for him to go, which was so perfect. Um, some areas they make him deliver it as early like 7 or 6 in the morning, 7, 8 in the morning. Um, but he leaves. Anyway, they got here just in time to add the rest of the stuff for his lunch. So that was so perfect. And I picked up some other things. Um, yeah. Okay, so um, I got some green grape. I'm sorry, red grapes. And the plates I got, I did my order from Harris Teeter. And I usually just coupon at Harris Teeter. Some things I will get if it's on sale. But Harris Teeter can be expensive. So um, I try to get stuff that's on sale or coupons with sales. Or something that they only have. So um, I did get these bowls. They are small, but um, the boys will eat more ice cream than this but i was like i need to start picking up some bowls for them and then i picked up some paper plates these are a little small they weren't that much it was like two dollars or a dollar and something so some red grapes i got some bacon potatoes so we have baked potatoes one day this is the first time we picked this up the mountain trail mix it was quite pr quite pricey it was like 4.98 um but I like this one because it doesn't have the sunflower seeds in it, even though I can eat it. They have other varieties, too. I got some almonds, the honey, I'm sorry, hickory smoke flavor. This is $4.98, too. So, Jason and I was like, as soon as we get in here, we don't spend, he said 30 but I was like, that's $20 because we picked up these two bags and then picked up on the trail mix. He picked up two boxes of those. And this is a sweet and salty combination and it does come with sunflower seeds and that one we got some grape jelly i do want to go to costco and pick up some stuff but i have to see how that goes because i am going back to aldi that's what i was going to say um i mainly wanted to get like non-perishable stuff or canned goods today but i'm going to go back to aldi and get like some frozen stuff and some meat but jason had to clean out the freezer the big freezer had been cleaned out in a while and i defrosted and he cleaned it out today so that's getting all cold again and then i'll go back and i'll share with you guys what i pick up then okay so I, i've been making my spaghetti sauce out of this i haven't forgot about that video um i picked up six cans of this and it's 79 cents uh, jason some of this stuff he picked up too so we got the cinnamon applesauce I have to look and see. I haven't been to Costco. I'm sure they have stuff like this. Um, but it's fine to get it at Aldi because, you know, they everybody doesn't eat the same thing in here. So here's the original applesauce. I got some cans of tuna fish. This is something to keep on hand, especially if you need to go to the store, you don't feel like cooking or, you know. Um, some Old Spice Pure sport high performance jason picked up two um deodorants of those let's see some hot sauce some peanut butter they go through that really quickly and some ketchup i also got some sharp cheddar cheese some hot jalapenos uh, jason picked up some strawberry preserves some black pepper he also picked up some honey um, some barbecue sauce. They always need barbecue sauce on something. I got two things of the ranch because they go through it like water and some mustard. Then I got some bacon and I probably put it in the freezer because I already have some but I just wanted to get some. I haven't tried the sweet and salty nut chocolatey pretzel and almonds before so I wanted to try it. Um, granola bars and then I got oh no I wasn't paying attention. I was trying to get two cashews and I end up getting this peanut dark chocolate and almond. So I may give that to Trail. I don't know. I may give some of it to Trail or give it all to him when he goes back to school. 
Um, because JJ doesn't like nuts. Jason doesn't like chocolate. So, yeah. Um, just how I may eat it. Some almond, not almond, some aluminum foil. Some oranges. I think we have two bags of oranges up here. I got four boxes of the corn muffin mix. There's the trail mix, two boxes. I got the toaster tarts. They love the um, frosted brown sugar. I probably actually should have got maybe three because they really go through that. I only picked up two of the shells and cheese. I remember when this stuff was like 89 cents, um, but now it's like 115. And um, we don't really eat too much mac and cheese, but just uh, Cottrell loves mac and cheese. So anyway, I just got this for a meal. We got one thing of the ramen chicken 12 pack and then the other ones are the cup of noodles uh three of those so they're all the same they're just and that one's in a different packaging and jj just asked me the other day ma i remember when you was coupon because i started back couponing y'all so let me know thumbs this video up or let me know down in the comments that you do want to see or continue to see those um i have some to edit but um yeah, my boys are just eating more and we're going back to the store more often and I just want to get those things at really good prices or food and stuff. So let me know if you want to continue to see those on the channel because I've been trying to only show certain things on the channel and I don't want to go completely left, which is not completely left because it's groceries. <laughs> so anyway, JJ was like, Ma, I remember when you would always get i can't think of what the name of the company is but it was another ramen company that always their noodles were free and so he was like yeah i like the kind in the cup so that's why i got those and i told him i don't get it all the time because you don't get as much and it costs more so i got him those today and whoever else trail may take one back to school okay so up here this is the main thing i've been wanting to stock up on forever um, it's some canned goods, so I don't get a lot of canned goods, but sometimes because I don't use them quite as much, um, I use a lot of frozen or fresh, but I did want to stock up on this because sometimes I'm like running low and I'm like, I don't have a veggie or something like that. So I got 12 of the whole potatoes, which I believe were these 45 cent Jason. They were more. Uh, they were a more. And then the cut green beans, I got 12 of these. So 12 fits in here. Um, the cut green beans were 38 cents at my store. Um, sometimes Harris Teeter will lower their stuff about 38 cents, 29 cents, but I have to catch it. And I always say, I'm going to go tomorrow. I'm going to go tomorrow. And I never go. So really, Aldi is a great, really, really good, good price. If you can't catch it at another store like Kroger or something like that, we don't have any more Kroger's. Okay, so I got some pinto beans. I don't remember how much these were, y'all. Um, probably 45 or 49 cents. Um, let's see, I got five of those, and then the kidney beans, we use these all the time with chili beans, so I got quite many of those, let's see, six, seven, eight, eight of those. Okay, so the mixed vegetables, they were 38 cents, I believe, um, as well, and I got two, four, six, eight. And then over here, I got the French style green beans. I didn't get any carrots. I didn't get any mushrooms, which they have. Um, yeah, I really don't really get mushrooms too much. You guys probably noticed. But four, five, six, seven, eight, nine of the French cut green beans. I got eight of the corn. I didn't get any cream corn either. They didn't have any yams, which I really wasn't going to get, but... I got some northern beans. I think I got six of these, which these are like 49 cents. And the pork and beans, I got uh, five of those because I don't get that. I don't cook that quite much. Usually if we have something like beans and weenies, which the kids like, which you don't have much, um, I use baked beans. We used to use pork and beans, but I use baked beans in mine. So that's it for those canned goods. I do have some more over here. We got two bushels of bananas. I don't know how many pounds that is. Um, I probably can estimate maybe about six, seven pounds of bananas. Um, one head of cabbage, two things of the original applesauce, and then two things of the um, Lunch Buddy strawberry applesauce. 
the other oranges. Um, the spring mix is like $3.59 and it's a lot more and I don't know why I'm just now realizing or either Walmart changed the sizes on me which I think they did made it a little bit smaller. So I will try my best to get it at Aldi instead of at Walmart because it's about the same price. Jason picked up two bags of the veggie chips, the Clancy veggie chips. And then we got two loaves of bread. I probably go, every time I go in the store, I usually pick up loaves of bread. Or you guys will see me pick up like four at a time because they'll freeze well in the freezer. Um, but we have, I think, two loaves right now. I picked up some yellow onions, some great tomatoes. I did pick up some pita whole wheat bread. You can put this in the freezer if you don't use it right away. Um, some boulder paper plates. I got two of the 80-20 and usually when I when I picked this up is when I realized that it was time to go because <laughs> Trail had to go to work. But um, he drove himself to work today. But I was like, oh, we got to go because I took the keys with me. Okay, so I got one thing of the 80-20 and this price is really going up. It's $3.19 a pound. No. Yeah. So it's really gone up. I remember when it was like six, close to seven dollars. I got four of the Mommy Cozy Original Thin Pepperoni Pizza. You know what, Jason? I should have got some cheese for Saya. And then I got some Italian seasoned croutons, some cheese and garlic. But we were rushing when we got to the frozen part. I picked up a few things, but I'm gonna have to go back anyway, which was the plan, and our buggy was full. The cheese and garlic croutons. I got two of the real bacon pieces. Then I got the sharp cheddar cheese and the Kobe Jack cheese. Um, such as like non-perishables, I really didn't really, really, I wanted to get the stuff that we needed, but I didn't want to stock up on it too much because I really didn't have um, an idea because I didn't plan on really getting this stuff, that stuff today. Mainly like the non-perishable stuff. So Jason picked this up. I don't know how much this was, y'all. The chocolate salted caramel pure protein bar value pack. And then um, the potato O'Brien. I just was walking by the counter. The frozen, you know, frozen thing um, on the floor. And I was like, oh my God, they got potatoes O'Brien. And you guys, I made a video on this. And I had no idea that video... Which I know to some people is nothing. But 24,000, 20, 21,000 views. And to someone, I don't know who it was. They pointed it out. But anyway, um, I'll make sure I find that video and link it. But um, I made this and I love this. So I've grabbed two bags and I'll probably grab two more when I go back. Because they don't have this all the time. I got some Chewy Dip Chocolate Chip Bars. And this was in my Harris Teeter haul. They only have this at Harris Teeter. And I think Brian said, um, our friend Brian, I think he said at Sam's. So I don't see that everywhere. Walmart doesn't even have it. Target may have it, but everybody doesn't have it. It's so good. The Blackberry Ginger Ale. Um, the Ragu, I got this absolutely free at Harris Teeter with couponing. I got six of them. Okay, y'all, we're almost done. Um, let's see. Jason wanted some, he told me about some cheap fruit, non-perishable fruit. So, they were needing to restock, I believe, and it was more than what he thought. And I was like, well, that's cheaper than it is at Walmart. Well, it might be about the same price. So, um, the Great Value brand. So, I got six, no, four of the fruit cocktail. Wait a minute. What is the difference? Fruit cocktail and 100% fruit juice. He got four of those. And then the fruit cocktail and heavy syrup. They only had three cans. Okay. Then over here. And I think these were like 95 cents or something like that, y'all. So they weren't super cheap. The sweet peas, I got 12 of those. And that was 38 cents. So usually the stream beans, the corn... Um, the peas, and I don't know about the mixed vegetables, I believe were like 38 cents. Um, the beans are a little bit more. Let's see. The black eyed peas, I got six of these. And I believe these were 49 cents. Because I was like, 49 cents? I got some black beans. And I got six of those. And, um, yeah, six of those. Then, let's see. The diced tomatoes. Let's see. This is the 
fire roasted diced tomatoes with seasonings. I got three. Did I only get three? I thought I got four of these. Hmm. I did. And then I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of the regular diced tomato, basil, garlic, and oregano. They do have the regular ones, and I think these are like 45 cents. Yeah, 45 cents. They do have the regular ones, but I didn't want regular. And all I had to do was look at the top. Okay, so I got some tomato sauce. And this is good to have on hand anyway in case, you know, you need whatever um, to fix, you know, some extra sauce for whatever you're making. So, um, I got 12 of these. Yeah, 12 of these, and these are a quarter. So, I don't know. I may pick up some more when I go in there. I have to figure out where I'm going to put all this stuff. Um, I can put it in my pantry, but I need to clean my pantry out again real good. And then I need to... Um, I don't know if I'm going to put the canned goods because I have wire shells and I need to get some, what's it called? Some built-ins. Okay, so Jason picked this up, y'all. So, I don't eat this Vienna sausages. I tried. I remember, I think it was JJ or Trail. They love this, but I don't know if they really eat it anymore. So, it's a total of, let's see, 6 and 4, 28 in here. So, and I think, how much were these buying the sausage, Jason? 29 cents a piece. 29 cents a piece, y'all. So, guys, that is everything that I got. <laughs> I'm about to put up all the cold stuff. The other stuff, I'm going to have to figure out where to put. I think right now, I used to have like a shelf in my laundry room, but I need to redo my laundry room. So it's like cluttered in there right now. So I may have to just make a little space and get some shelves. Which Aldi actually has shelves on sale this week. And I need some shelves upstairs. Um, I think I'm going to put the cleaning products and paper towels and stuff I've been stockpiling. Which you guys probably will see by this video. Um, I'm going to put those upstairs in that little area that used to be my craft room. Craft area. Which I'll link that video if you haven't seen that. But I have another craft room now. Um... But anyway, um, yeah, I think that's what I'm going to do. And I don't want to take the food upstairs, the stockpile of food. That will stay down here, like right in my laundry room. And I have an old video of what that looks like, which I'll link that too. So if you can see where I had all that stuff before. I didn't have a whole lot, but I had some stuff. Okay, guys. So thanks so much for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Check out my blog. Um, subscribe to my email list. Thank you. Those who have um, didn't subscribe for my email list and stayed on. I'm sure you guys didn't. There's probably other people um, that just found me. And um, thank you for those who replied back. I love reading all of those. And I'm still going to reply back. And I'm sending out a new email soon. I'm going to try to do one every single week. That was fun. And then I also down below I will put... A meal plan sheet as well meal plan sheet you can check it out on my blog you can subscribe and then on the blog when you subscribe to my free printable you have access to everything in there um, what I have listed and it has a meal plan two different types of templates so guys thanks so much for watching don't forget to comment like subscribe I'll see you guys in the very next video or the next stock up bye bye